Hey, what's happening out there, guys? It's Roll Easy here, and I'm back with another GTA 5 online video. And I'm not the only one that's back. This solo money glitch is also back. We have had a lot of patches, okay? I've updated all the pinned comments on the videos that have been patched. You know, the money glitches, the modded outfits, all that is gone for now, okay? But they did unpatch Tudo Facile France's solo money glitch so we're gonna be going over how to do that and it's really freaking easy okay so what you're gonna need for this glitch is you need a full facility and you want to go ahead and throw your retro custom or, or whatever Benny's vehicle you're duping inside of the facility you also need an Avenger all right and you do not need custom plates for this glitch it's a no custom plates glitch you get a fresh plate every single time you want a Lester heist text okay to do that you want to go ahead and just start up like the Fleece job or something like that do the first setup and then wait for a few minutes for lester to uh, you know send you a text okay you can do this in an invite only session or a you know a close friend session it's completely up to you it works in both uh rh eights inside of your heist garage okay the way you know if you select that green one right there if you select that that you know that text it'll launch you into an apartment that's your heist apartment so you want to go ahead and throw rh eights in that garage all right once you've done that, you also need the MOC with the personal vehicle storage, and that's going to be how we're saving the vehicle. Now, Xbox, you need a friend in another targeting mode to join. PlayStation, all you need is a recent activity. I will be showing you how to hit the glitch on both consoles, all right? It's a dual console video. First, we're going to be showing you how to hit the glitch on Xbox. Then I'm going to be showing you how to, hit, how to hit the glitch on PlayStation. So go ahead and run into your Avenger that's inside of your facility, okay? Once you have everything set up, obviously. Now... Xbox, I guess I would recommend you guys going into free aim because most people do play on assisted aim. So I'm in a free aim session right now on Xbox. What you're going to do is you're going to walk up to where it says this door. It's going to pop up a message that says enter cockpit, okay? What you want to do now is go ahead and open up your dashboard and you want to join a friend that's in another targeting mode. So like I said, I'm in free aim. I know most people play in assisted aim. So I'm going to go ahead and join a friend that's probably in assisted aim. All right, I'm just going to spam on join game and I'm going to keep spamming A to hit enter cockpit. Then I'm going to accept the first alert, decline the second. I should be glitched out like that. And then all of a sudden I'll glitch in the middle of the facility. Just like that. Super simple, guys. I know the alerts on Xbox are a little iffy, but if you find your timing, you can definitely hit that. It's not too difficult, okay? So once you've done that and you're in the middle of the floor, go ahead and go to your Lester text, the green one, the high setup, and go ahead and just launch it. Now what's going to happen is you're going to be shot up in the clouds. You will be shot up in the clouds and eventually spawn down over at your heist department. All right, and this is wherever you started like the Fleece job or whatever heist, you know, you ended up doing to be able to get this text. And if you want to know, you know, what what uh, garage to put your RH8s your in, this is how you know when you go ahead and you do this, all right? So back out of that heist board, you should be, have a really glitchy like super bright screen and stuff like that go ahead and go to this door and hit enter garage make sure you're entering garage and not exiting the apartment because it can screw up the glitch so once you're in your garage what you're going to do is you're going to walk up to an rh8 all right so remember i said fill up this garage with rh8s for this video i have a few rh8s in here and some dupes and stuff like that but you definitely want if you're going to be doing this glitch over and over and over again i say fill up this entire garage with rh8s just to make it nice and easy so I'm going to go ahead and hop into this uh, LG RH8 right here. I'm going to wait for the engine to start, and I'm going to count about 5 to 10 seconds. I recommend just sitting here for 10 seconds, okay? So sit here for 10 seconds, and then once that time is up, go ahead and hold right trigger or R2, all right? Just hold it. You'll see a little weird little flicker there, and just hold it until you see yourself at the facility, okay? So you see I'm at the facility now. I can go ahead and let go, and there we go, all right? I've glitched all the way and, like, teleported over here. Now, check out the plate on this car, okay? It's a 06BKP476, okay? Just remember BKP, all right? So once you're done, once you've done that, remember you needed a full facility for this. Go ahead and drive your RH8 up to your facility, accept the full alert. It's gonna tell you that you need to remove a vehicle, okay? That's all good, don't worry about that. You're gonna see exactly what we do right here. It's mad freaking easy. Those of you who remember know exactly what you're doing, all right? Now, once you've done that, you're going to get the vehicle management selection. Go ahead and replace over an LG Retro Custom or whatever Benny's vehicle you're duplicating. Confirm it, and you see that Retro Custom is still there, all right? You would think it would turn into an RH8. No, no, no. It's actually merging the plates, but it hasn't merged yet. You're going to see right now how we get it to do that. So what you want to do is just run over to that LG Retro Custom or whatever Benny's vehicle you're duplicating. Remember, only Benny's vehicles. That's all we dupe. And hop into it and check out the plate right now. You see, I have a custom plate on here. It says Hunter. All right. Once I drive this out, you're going to see that the plate actually changes. 
So you see that right there? The plate right there, BKP, all right? That's the new plate, okay? So now you have a fresh, clean duplicate. What you wanna go ahead and do is actually call up your MOC with the personal vehicle storage, and you wanna drive this over there to save the vehicle, okay? Once you've saved the vehicle, you're good to go, all right? You've basically duplicated a car. So you see, you can dupe a car every five minutes, basically, with this glitch. It's mad freaking simple, and you can do it basically solo. Xbox, those of you who don't have friends in another targeting mode, join communities, go into lobbies, and just join random people until they add you, or add random people until they add you back, all right? It's not difficult to get friends to join for glitches, all right? You don't have to talk to them. You don't have to use them. You don't have to even know them, all right? I'm telling you, it's super easy. When I didn't have friends, that's all I did. All right, I just added random people in lobbies. Okay, so now the vehicle is saved. What you want to do is exit trailer. Sometimes, and you're going to see that uh, both sides of the coin, sometimes you will actually spawn in the city for some reason. When you exit the trailer doing this glitch, you just end up spawning in the city. This happens to me on Xbox every time. On PlayStation, it doesn't. But look at that. I spawn in the city. Now, I recommend that you have a lesser text to go back to the uh, facility because you see now I can actually just launch up the Lester text to go to the facility and I can actually continue with the glitch so you're gonna see I'm gonna actually launch into the heist room once I'm in the heist room there you go I can run back to my Avenger and I can actually do the glitch over again okay that's how you rinse and repeat super super quick and you can keep going and going now I'm gonna show you how to do the glitch on PlayStation which is even easier because you're using a recent activity and recents are truly amazing I'm not gonna lie okay so Go inside of your Avenger, walk up to the area, you know, to enter the cockpit. Make sure you get the message in the top left. So you see, I'm just going to edge up to it. There we go. I got the message. I'm going to open up my PlayStation dashboard and I'm going to go find a friend's recent to go ahead and join. Okay. So I'm going to go to activities right here and I got some recents there. So, you know, I got a, I got a bounty. So this one, you want to find a recent that says Star GT Online. So you see, if I scroll down on the right side, Star GT Online, double tap the PS button. Now hit enter cockpit and double tap the PS button. So here we go. Enter cockpit, double tap the PS button, Star GT Online, decline the alert. Just like that. Okay. Nice and easy. All right. If that recent loads up quick, you're good to go. It is mad easy to do. And just like you saw before, I'm going to go ahead and load up a Lester Heist text and I will eventually go ahead and spawn in my apartment. Okay. And same thing, guys, you want to, if you really want to make this glitch worth your while, fill up that garage. All right. Fill up that garage completely with RH8. You want 10 RH8s in there so you can keep doing this back to back. You can probably get the entire garage duped in an hour. If you're selling retros for a million bucks a piece, you do the math, man. That's a lot of money. They're a little bit under a million. So it's probably around 9 million, you know, or so, but Hey, it's worth it. So back out of the high sport. Once you spawn in, hit enter garage, make sure you do not exit apartment. Like I said it can ruin the glitch not always but it is possible that it can ruin the glitch all right we had an old one that was very similar to this that we used a, a lester heist text so run into your garage find the rh8 that you're going to be duping over okay so i'm going to go ahead and hop into here remember wait for the engine to start and now count to five to ten seconds i'm going to say just count 10 seconds all right just a flat 10 all right it's five seconds extra no problem okay now go ahead and press R2 and hold it until you see yourself at the facility. So just hold the gas and look, I'm at the facility now. Good to go. I've teleported over here. I'm going to show you the plate like always so that you know what plate we're going to be getting on our brand new dupe. So check it out. SSY in the very middle. And that's going to be our fresh plate that we're going to be getting on the retro custom. So drive it into your full facility. This is why we need it to be full. You need that alert to be able to do this part. And once we spawn in there, we're gonna be spawning in on the vehicle management selection menu. Once we're on here, you're gonna go ahead and replace over the retro custom that you're trying to dupe or whatever Benny's vehicle you're duping. There we go, I've replaced over it. You should still see the LG retro custom. It won't go anywhere, you won't be losing it. All that's doing is actually merging the plate, but you don't see it until you actually drive out. So I'm gonna hop into it right here. You're gonna see I have a custom plate on here already and that's gonna be changing. It says glitching. Now I'm just gonna, you know, press right trigger or R2 to drive out. Once you've done that, check it out. I got the brand new plate on here, SSY in the middle. There we go. So guys, it's that easy, man. I'm telling you, most people can do this, you know, like nothing, man. This is the glitch to take advantage of right now after the brand new update. If you wanna get some cars, you know, if you wanna buy those new cars, do this glitch, man. Do this glitch, you know, for, for the rest of the night and you'll have enough money to buy all the new cars that just came out today. All right. So 
This is the one to take advantage of. So remember, at this point, you still need to save the car. You want to call up your MOC with the personal vehicle storage, and it doesn't matter if it's empty or full, all right? It doesn't matter just if it's full, a vehicle will just be transferred over to wherever you got the original car from, and go ahead and press right D-pad and select, you know, to drive in, all right? Simple as that, guys. So that's how you save the car. That's how you do the glitch on PS4 and Xbox. And remember I said on Xbox, I always spawn out in the city when I exit the trailer. Look at this on PS4, I spawn right outside. Side. But either way, you can call up your like your motorcycle club menu, you know, and call up an oppressor and fly over to the facility, or you can just have that Lester Heist text and just spawn in your facility nice and easy, okay? So those are the, all the options you got. I'm pretty sure I covered all the bases of this glitch so far, at least for this method. And I hope you guys, you know, take advantage of this, all right? So that's gonna be it for me. My name is Roll Easy. Make sure if you're brand new to the channel, you you hit that red subscribe button, man. That big red subscribe button right under all my videos. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Road to 25,000 subscribers. Peace out, guys.